Volume 2 of Season 4 Stranger Things comes out in less than a week and a lot of theories are going around on TikTok and people are starting to speculate what's going to happen at the end of Season 4 going to Season 5 and I'm here to tell you a theory that I've seen on TikTok, that I've talked about on TikTok and that I think is probably the most realistic considering the things that are adding up here. Um, so without further ado, make sure to drop a like, subscribe and comment if you want to see more TV show content and let me talk about this insane theory. So this theory revolves around the fact that the Upside Down is on a different timeline than the real world. It's in the past. Now, why is it in the past? Well, we've seen Nancy at the end of season four, volume one. She's in the, tr in the, in the trance, or whatever you call it, from Vecna. And she's walking around Vecna's house, and she sees Vecna as a kid. And what Vecna is doing is he's staring at the grandfather clock that every single person who gets in the trance sees, right? Well, what he's... When he was staring at this clock, he was a kid, but he still had his powers. So how is the Upside Down in the past if Vecna is in charge of it? Well, what if Vecna, as a kid, used his powers to make that clock stop time? And that's how Vecna is currently immortal, right? So he used that clock when he was a kid to stop time in the Upside Down, and that's why he's immortal, okay? Okay. That's the theory right now. But this is where it gets kind of insane. If he's immortal, how are we going to kill him? Well, on that clock, there's actually a keyhole, okay? And now it's going to go, now I'm going to go in like a whole different direction, sort of. You remember that therapist at school where Max went and all the other people who got uh, the Vecna sickness went and talked to? Kelly is her name. I don't know if I just said that, but Kelly, she has a necklace around her neck. And on that necklace, you can see a key, and that key has a clock on it, okay? So what if that key around Kelly's neck is the key to that grandfather clock to make it go on the same timeline as the real world so that Vecna's mortal, okay? So my theory is, basically the theory is, is Vecna stopped time when he was a kid with the grandfather clock. That's why it's so important, and that's why everyone who gets sick, uh, the Vecna sickness sees the clock. And now the only thing that the kids can do to defeat Vecna is to find that key and use it on the clock to where the Upside Down is on the same timeline as the real world and then Vecna will be mortal, okay? So my theory is, is that that's going to happen and at the se end of season four, they're going to find out what they need to do and then at the and going to season five, they're going to try to find the key and then eventually defeat Vecna. I think, that, I think that's pretty much the whole basis of the theory. But obviously, I'm going to explain a little bit more here and, uh, you know, just talk about why this makes so much sense. Obviously, this isn't the only thing that's going to happen in Volume 2 Season 4. This is just a small storyline theory that revolves around Vecna and his storyline. Uh, obviously, we know that Elle is still in the training facility with Dr. Brenner and all that stuff. And she's going to probably blow up that building like we saw in the trailer. And then Joyce and Hopper have their own storyline with Murray. And then all the kids are going to get back together in Hawkins. So a lot of other stuff is going to happen. But I made this theory just to talk about the big one uh, with Vecna. And it would make sense because if Vecna gets defeated at the end of Season 4, I don't know how they would go about it in Season 5. So I don't think he's going to get defeated in Season 4. I think, I think what's going to happen is that they're going to find a solution on how to defeat Vecna in Season 4. And then they're going to go with th like execute that plan in Season 5. And that's how they're going to defeat Vecna. Uh, and that's why this series makes so much sense, because I feel like the transition from this into season five would really provide some, you know, amazing storyline into season five and actually make sense instead of just like having a different villain going to season five. Or, like, I don't know what they would do if they defeat Vecna at the end of volume two. I don't know what they would do going into season five. So I think this is the most realistic theory. And uh, as far as like if Kelly's evil or not, that's a whole nother theory. I don't know, like, if she accidentally got that key. But regardless, that's kind of huge as well. Like, she could have something to do with something. And, uh, I mean, there's, like, there's so many theories about so many characters because that's what, that's what the Duffer Brothers do. Like, they're, they're going to throw in some, like, crazy twist. Like, whoever we think is going to die is not going to die. And whoever we don't think is going to die is going to die. You know what I'm saying? That's what the, the Duffer Brothers do. So... I don't know, guys. This storyline's insane. It's so deep. Like it's like I make Fortnite theories. If you guys are new here, or whatever. Uh, and this storyline is like ten times more confusing than the Fortnite storyline, or ten times more not confusing, but like deep. 
So there's a lot more stuff that's going on. So like this theory may seem big, but it's honestly like just like one piece of the puzzle. Like there's so many different storylines that could I could talk about or different theories that I could talk about and I will talk about. So if you want me to talk about any other specific character and what's gonna happen, or whatever, drop a comment and I'll be sure to try to make a theory about that. Uh, but this theory I saw on TikTok and I thought it was insane. So let me know what you guys think about it and if it makes sense and if you think it's gonna happen. And uh, let me know if you want to make me uh, want me to make another video before Volume Two releases because I kind of want to, uh, but I just have to see what I'm gonna talk about. But without further ado, guys, make sure to drop a like, subscribe, ten post notifications, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.